everybody welcome back to cards by the hill my name is jane hill so this is going to be another card project but this time it's going to be for a little one whose birthday is coming up and you haven't got any particular ideas of what to make you're short on time so i'm going to give you an idea Okay, piece of yellow Gina K cardstock. And what we're going to do is fold it in half this way. So it's going to be horizontal, not vertical. The sheet itself is 11 inches by eight and a half. I don't think it's quite A4 size. All right. Then what we're going to do is from the middle. So it's eight and a half. So we want four and a quarter. Is the middle. So we're going to go about, I want to make sure he's, he's quite big. So we'll go two and a half, draw a line. Two and a half, draw a line. Then you're going to add shoulders coming down off the side. Okay, just to the corner like that. So from where I've done that one, which was one and three quarter inches down, going to bring the side down to the to the corner like that then we're just going to cut that out up to the line and take it up to the top and do the same on the other side you could also make these with your children. They're simple enough as long as they're supervised. Just going to follow the line round. Like that. So that's what you should be left with. Okay. Opening like that. Right, so once you've done that, you're going to cut off the front shoulder, so along your line, like that. Then you're left with something that looks like this. Okay. We're going to shape the front piece. So we're just going to cut off these corner pieces. Just to give it a little bit of shape. And then you've got something that looks like that. Now, moving on, we're going to put googly eyes on him. Because what kid doesn't love googly eyes? Two nice big, big ones like that. I don't think 
think they're sticky, are they? No. Might have to hot glue those. I'm just going to glue them with Nuvo. I don't think they'll stick, to be honest. There we go, so there's his googly eyes. And we're gonna add a nose. And some whiskers. So let's put a big nose in the middle there just using a black sharpie coming down like that and then some whisker dots on either side And we've just got to add some ears so using the pieces we've cut off we're going to shape some ears Okay, so we're going to shape some ears and cut those out. So that's going to go on like that. Then we're going to have one on the other side that's droopy. So let's draw one again on this side. Right, one ear's going like that. One ear's going to have a bend in it off to the side and that's our little dog just gluing them on with Nuvo so you know they're really quick really easy nothing special but a kid would find that quite amusing, I think. So that's the dog. Now let's try, uh, let's try a crocodile. So we want green. Okay, so this is just normal cardstock. Again, we're going to fold it in half. So it's horizontal. This one, I think this one is A4. So this one is 11 and a quarter, sorry. 11 and three quarters by eight and a half. Right, and again, we're gonna use the same principle. So we're gonna go in Two and a half again from each side. Draw our lines. Then we've got to do our shoulders. So we come down. about one and a half inches on the line from where we marked it. Bring the shoulder down to the corner. Again, go across, mark the spot, bring the shoulder down to the corner. 
Okay. Do the same as we did before. So we cut off the shoulders. How many googly eyes do you have in your stash? You've never used them. <laughs> there we go. Okay, get rid of the front shoulder. And you've got something like that. Let's mark out the shape of the face again. So this is going to be the crocodile. So we want two nostrils here. Then we're going to do his eyes on some extra card. So from your scraps that you've cut off, you're just going to make two arches like that. And then we're going to put some googly eyes on there. So this size. Okay. On go the googly eyes. There we go, there's the crocodile. Alright, so we've got two so far, the dog and the crocodile. So let's try something that needs a little bit more work. So let's try a bird. Okay. And it started off at... Oh, 11 and 3 quarters by... 8 and a quarter. Okay. Again, horizontal. We're going to make our marks for our lines. So two and a half, two and a half. Bring our shoulders down, so let's have a look this time. About three inches up. Bring your shoulder down, three inches up. I'm gonna cut those as we've done before. So this time, from where the shoulder starts, Take a line down to the centre of the bottom of the card and then on the opposite side a line down to meet that one. Then you're going to cut not only the shoulder off but also the piece at the side of the beak. Like that. So you've got something looking like this okay now we're going to give him a different colored beak so we're going to give him an orange beak from about there so all we're going to do is get some different colored card that's a beautiful orange look at that and then Place your beak on the card and draw around it and cut that out. 
and that should fit on your beak. Here we go, so there's the beak. Now, I'm going to add a bit of shape to the top here. I'm just going to cut off these little edges here at the top just to make it rounded. It looks more like a head. And we want two big googly eyes at the top there. be good for the kids to uh, get stuck into so these googly eyes are going right next to each other there we go and then you've got bird right so I've got pink and light blue these are the same size sheets and they're 11 and 3 quarters by 8 and a quarter so we're going to do the horse so again, cardstock in half, horizontally. And we're going to do our measurements for the head. So two and a half. So again, we cut round the shoulder. And then down from the top, we lose the front shoulders. So we cut those off. And we're left with that again. Okay. From there. We lose these corners on the front. Go. Now we're going to need ears, eyes, and a little tuft of hair at the top here. So for that, we've got the light blue. So let's just give him a couple of nostrils first with a sharpie. So those are in the corners there. Then we're going to cut square piece doesn't have to be a particular size or anything then we're going to cut some squares in it and we're going to cut some strips Don't go too mad, just so he's got a little tuft of hair. So something like that. Then we're going to go in and cut each one shorter so it's a little bit rough and that's going to be his little little tuft of hair there so we glue that on stickers and all sorts on him so that's his little bit of hair 
Then we can put his googly eyes on. Let's give him some googly eyes. There we go. So he needs some ears. And then we're going to go up. And do a little triangular shape at the top there. Just follow it round. There is a lot of fussy cutting, I'm afraid. But, you know, all in good fun. Okay, so those are going to be the years. And he's done. And I think after four of them, you get the general idea. Okay, so there are four card ideas. Very easy, very simple, very quick for half term. Or if you need to make them yourself for a group of kids. There we are. So as I do in all my videos, I want to thank you for your likes. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. It means the world to me. Thank you for taking the time out to watch the videos and for leaving comments. Really enjoy those. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.